Welcome to the channel. This is my arms going like this because it's welcoming. Why is my mouth like that? Ah, oh, my ribs. Damn it. I'm two years into healing and laughter is not the best medicine right now. So I'm laughing on the inside. <laughs> Maybe I can work on deadpan. Oh, that's a great idea. I'll work on deadpan humor. That's, why did I think of that two years ago? This whole time I could have been mastering the art of deadpan humor. I'm gonna Google that, hang on. Deadpan humor. Dry humor, dry wit humor is the deliberate display of emotional, yes, this is it. The deliberate display of emotional neutrality or no emotion. Oh, this is so good, this is so good. I'll just have to laugh on the inside and then enjoy other people's laughter. Perfect, okay. Let's just, Roll that into a ball of, this is, I'm, I'm making cookies right now. This is a cookie. We're putting that cookie in the oven of ideas. Okay. And setting it. Okay. Nope, no laughing. No laughing. This is gonna be hard. This is not my natural state, being serious. Okay. I feel like a newscaster now. Okay, like I have my arms folded in my lap and I'm ready to do the evening news. All right. So the reason that I, okay, I'm not gonna talk, okay. Just be normal, be normal, be normal, be normal, be normal. Please be normal, just be normal. Okay, you cannot be normal when you're being filmed. Sorry, why is my voice like that? Like, okay, you can't, all I'm saying, let's just be calm. You cannot be normal. No, what? I'm, I'm like literally trapped right now in a, some, trying to find the right personality to put on and I can't find it. I am trying to explain to you guys, this is not easy. It is not easy to sit in front of a camera. Why am I yelling at the audience? Okay, I'm not, I'm not angry with you. I am feeling a little defensive because to try to sit in front of an audience and be vulnerable, which is what I'm trying to do, is not easy. And the camera adds so much pressure and put such a spotlight on you that you kind of freeze in the headlights there and you just don't know what to do. That's been my experience with this YouTube. I also feel very encouraged by the fact that I've been doing this for four and a half months and have not given up yet. And I don't know if I'm making any progress on any different metrics like clarity of speech or emotional delivery or any of those things because I'm not measuring them and I'm not thinking about them. I'm just sitting here talking and hoping that something good happens. Um, so the fact that I've gotten subscribers like every day, I get another subscriber, like that just keeps happening. So that in and of itself tells me something good is happening. Some connections are being made and people have some interest, whether it's positive, negative, neutral, who cares in what I'm saying. Um, I have no idea what it is that you're all here for or how you found me because I haven't really like spoken directly to the viewers. <laughs> um, I feel like that was something I was waiting to see if it would just evolve naturally, which I guess maybe it is right now. Hello. Hey, out <laughs> hello. Hello. Are there actual people out there? It's the weird paradox. It's one of my least favorite paradoxes in life where you are the only person in your universe and, every, and yet there's all these other people that are others. And at the same time, it's all just you. And that is a weird thing to have to hold. Especially, and this is not my personal experience, well, maybe once, especially if you do psychedelics or things like that and you get into a trip of that. And the part where it's like, I'm the only one in the entire universe. Oh God, it's all just me. Even if you see, I mean, there's so many ways that can play out, you know, unity, consciousness and bliss and oh, or just total acceptance of the fact. But like the one where it's like, oh God, you have such a self-awareness or like a self-centeredness. And so you think like, oh, I'm alone in the universe, which you are, by the way, you are. <laughs> But, it's, but it doesn't have to be a bad thing. It, it's like, it's kind of funny. It's kind of like if we can get comfortable with the fact that we are alone in the universe and that we're alone together. <laughs> uh, you know, and my mind from there goes like, maybe we could stop being such assholes to each other and killing each other. You know, I get into a really negative space around that. Whereas others are like, oh, I'm Shanti Dave. Let's pray together and like wear blissful clothing and sit in the sunlight and, you know, have... <laughs> You don't want to hear about that. 
You want some new content, right? You want new content today, tonight, right now, June. Not, I'm not going to say the date and the time. That's ridiculous. I need to stop with that. I use this as a, I'm afraid of undifferentiated time space continuum. that's just like ever present now. So I'll be like, oh, let's see, what time is it? Oh, God. Okay, I'm fine. It's 8.05. Oh, thank God. Okay, I'm okay. I'm still here. I'm fine. We're all good. Everything's fine. And I'm, just, I'm like calming myself down here. Eh, it's okay. You're okay. <laughs> Anyways, um, just glad to have you all here. And I see I've looked in my YouTube statistics. There's a whole demographic. There's all the different ages, the different genders, the different countries. You know, we're just this huge melting pot of this whole collective world of people that are all mixing and mingling on YouTube and elsewhere. So I'm glad to have you here. And I hope that we can continue this conversation for as long as it goes. And I'll try to stay fresh. And I will, <laughs> I'm not there yet. I'm, I mean, I am, but I'm also like still getting ready to kind of just jump off. What is this that I'm doing here? The jumping off, just taking the, is this vomit? <laughs> ah, <laughs> I don't know. Well, uh, what, what is this? Ah, oh, or is it, ah, oh, yes, it's a beautiful emanation of love. That's what we'll say, <laughs> we'll say that. Anyways, all right. I am going to sign off for now. And this is going to be, I think I'm doing like two videos a week right now. Why do I, not that it's a bad thing, but I cannot stop moving my hands when I'm talking. I'm casting a spell, but the spell just takes like an hour and it doesn't do anything. <laughs> so, okay, wait a minute. That's a good topic for a video is magic. People are always talking. All right. Hey, will you just take a breath for a minute, please? I feel like you've been talking nonstop without breathing. Let's just see what happens if we... I'm talking to myself, by the way. Let's see what happens if we breathe. You have to talk to yourself like you're talking to a child because you are a child. <laughs> That's... That's the bottom line here. Uh, okay, let's just breathe again. <sighs> See, it's okay. You don't have to keep talking. You will still exist. Yep, we're still here. You might lose the audience because the audience is probably like looking for some rapid fire dopamine or maybe not. Maybe people are actually tired of that. Maybe people are starting to get a little bit tired of the instantaneous feedback and they're looking for something a little bit more chill and calm, at least some of the time. Because, well, don't we need a balance? Sometimes it's nice to have a million texts and rapid fire messages going everywhere, every which way. And also, sometimes it's nice to just go out into the middle of nature if you can find it. And if you can't, just go into the middle of the city but be cool about it and just be like, traffic, people, etc. Someone is flipping someone else off. Someone is beating someone up over there. It's fine. I'm cool. <laughs> I don't think that's how you would really approach that situation. But I think that... All right. Hmm... What I'm feeling is that I've missed my landing. There was an exit that I just missed. You know, like when you're driving on the highway and you're distracted and you miss your exit and now you've got to keep going to the next one and maybe even turn around and go back and you just wasted 15 minutes, 10 minutes. That's what happened. And unfortunately, I'm not sure what to do because this is a YouTube video, so it's not a highway. So I'm just going to keep driving down this really uncomfortable space where I should have signed off a minute or two ago and I feel really awkward about it. Uh, okay, and also that was just a metaphor that you made up and this is not a highway. This is whatever it is. And you can just recover from that. Get to an emotional equilibrium that feels nice and just wrap things up with a moment of smiling and breathing and 